So it's been a busy week for pediatricians as a lot of parents are rushing to get their younger kids vaccinated after the CDC approved that shot for kids aged 5 to 11. But 13 year old Judah Whaley is one of the older students who didn't hesitate to get his vaccine before. He says he helped set an example for his younger siblings. Our Savannah Levins has been following him throughout this whole school year as part of our Learning Curve series. Nearly halfway through his eighth grade year, Judah Whaley's learning to balance being a kid in a global pandemic and just being a kid. Well, we recently took the PSATs. It was kind of refreshing to take a paper test. So, you know, during COVID, like the kids who were taking even the SATs weren't able to take them for a long time. It seems kind of monumental. This day and age, if you're living right now experiencing this, then it's sort of like you're living through history. You're maybe even be making history right now. Monumental is a good word for the year he's had, from returning to school after 500 days of virtual learning, to quarantining after a COVID outbreak in his hallway and another on his football team, to getting the vaccine as soon as it was approved for his age group. Emotionally, you just gotta stay strong. He's also setting an example for his nine-year-old little brother, Jonah, who will soon get vaccinated too, now that the CDC is given the all clear. And I know it won't be a problem for him. He was there with me. It's for the better of you. You'll be safer with it, you know, just learn to live with the fact that sometimes you're gonna have to take extra steps to be safe. It'll be an added comfort as they head out of state to visit family for Thanksgiving, armed with that extra protection and with some extra perspective too. My plan is, you know, just be around family, really, live in that moment because I know it's amazing to be safe around them. 